Hello everyone. As we all know IBM Planning Analytics provides several features for quick and accurate results. Here we are sharing one best feature amongst many, that is custom process. This feature can potentially enhance and streamline business planning processes. What exactly custom process is? TI process can be triggered immediately before and immediately after the workflow action. This feature can be quite useful in a lot of ways. Some uses of triggering process before or after the workflow action. Updating BI reporting cube. Input latest actions from ERP. Notify other users when a node is committed. Sending a review or contributor an email on submit or reject of a node. The process to lock or unlock a node. Apart from all this usage, it really depends on your business and application, and how this feature may enhance your planning process. In our scenario, the user has requested to transfer the sales data to reporting cube to update linked reports to reporting cube. Here are a few simple steps for triggering a process automatically. Step 1, go to application design mode in performance modeler. Step 2, click on an application you wish to update. Step 3, in the properties pane, go to custom process and go to custom process settings. Step 4, in our scenario, we wish to run a T after submitting the data by the user. So we are selecting T in post tab. As we discussed previously, you can load the data from ERP even before taking ownership by the user just by selecting pre-process for commit. Or you can shoot an email after committing or submitting the data by the user. Save the changes made in the application and deploy it again. Note, only you cannot run a T before commit button. Do not forget to mention these four parameters in process which you wish to run. Let's check the result. Joey is doing budgeting for 2020 for Canada and United States. Before proceeding I would like to show you that input and reporting cube is different, named as I underscore sales and R underscore P and L respectively. As you can see there is no data in either of the cube, neither for Canada nor for United States. First, he is taking ownership of Canada. Now Joey has started budgeting. After committing, data has arrived in input cube that is I underscore sales. Let us submit the data. Once he submits the data, it will transfer to the reporting cube. Let's check the reporting cube. Voila, data has transferred successfully and ready to use for reporting. Isn't it a dynamic feature of IBM Planning Analytics? Thank you for watching the video. For any further details kindly contact our website that is www.veracities.com.